Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Aries. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is for February. This is for singles. This reading is for singles. Okay. So, Aries, what do we have for February for singles? Um, doesn't Just because I'm doing a singles reading doesn't mean that love is going to come flying into your life. Okay. We're just going to see what happens. What do we have for Aries that are single? What do we have? Ooh, now Six of Cups is the past, right? It's memories of the past. It's reminiscing. It's nostalgia. You could be connecting with somebody from your past. This could be even somebody from a past life, okay? This is a, could be a reunion, a reunion with someone from your past. This is definitely, um... It could be even romanticizing. This is with somebody that you have known before. Perhaps this is somebody from your childhood. Somebody that you grew up with. Uh, or somebody that you were with a long time ago. Um, this is somebody that you are definitely going to be very familiar with. This person is going to make you feel like... You know, they're going to help you to remember what love is, okay? This is a re this is a feelings of love, remembering what love is. So, remember, memories of love probably could be with somebody else. Definitely, this is a card of the past as well. So, it could be somebody that, you know, maybe somebody that has passed away is, is bringing you together with this person. This is um, somebody from the other side. This is um, a reconciliation. So there's some sort of reconciliation here, Aries, with somebody from your... And this is a past life as well. So it's either a past life connection or it's somebody from your past. That is what we have here. We have a reconciliation here with somebody that you are meant to be with. Okay? That is what we got. And I don't say that very freely. So this is definitely a reconciliation with somebody that you have known before. Whether you've known them in this lifetime or not. Okay? Um, interesting. These cards didn't... Oh my God! We have an Empress here. So this is a Taurus. Could be a Taurus. Or a Libra. This Or somebody that is a mother. This person is beautiful. She is generous. She is kind. She is loving. She is abundant. She is valuable. And she knows her value. And she has a lot of life experience. And she doesn't give herself away freely. So if you are the female, this is you taking on this energy of... This is beautiful grace, okay? This is beautiful abundance. I know my value. I know my worth. And I'm waiting for my emperor, okay? If you are the masculine, this is who you are uh, connecting with. This is somebody that is very... Um, this person seems to be a little voluptuous, okay? This person seems... She may have a big butt. I just happened to see that. That's interesting. Anyway, she's very down to earth because of the green. She's grounded. Um, she's motherly. She's caring. She's tender. She's a beautiful soul. Everybody can see it. She's she's a giver. Okay, so whoever this person is, uh, she is absolutely. Um, it feels like she. People are drawn. People are drawn to her because she's glowing. She's absolutely glowing. And and if you notice, think it's about it's time. It's time for it's harvest time. It's time. It's time. It's time for this to connect. It's time for this reunion. It's time for the delivery. It's time for this blessing. So it's time. This is rising up from the ashes. And this is being born again and being born. So this is, could be a rebirth of some, the rebirth of a, of a relationship or the birth of something new. Now this is put in effort, work hard. This is hard work. It's hard work to do something. Putting in effort. Unable to move on. Now we have a celebration. It's hard work moving on. It's hard work getting to a better place. There could be a distance. There could be some sort of distance here. Now this is some sort of upcoming celebration. Socializing, mingling, having fun. Maybe this starts out as friends. Okay, maybe this starts out as friends. and maybe Or maybe you start communicating on social media. 
or you you start dating because this is dating socializing having fun you could be out with your friends or, or something like that and you run into this person or you could even may have something to do with school or work maybe you worked with this person in the past or you went to school with this person in the past you may have mutual friends with this person may have there is definitely you're about to receive something because this is a blessing the empress receives a blessing she is a blessing Ooh, king of swords reverse now the king of swords reverse is somebody that is cold and uncaring harsh this is mental abuse there could be some mental health issues here Two not oh this is a three and this is a nine nine of pentacles this is exhausted stressed out worried depressed something not working out not on the same page hmm, somebody is not on the same page and it's because they're very hard and uncaring but this is release release the judgment is also a card of release release your worries uh, Aries, you may need to release your worries. You maybe maybe you're you're in protection mode because this is ex maybe there maybe you've been abused in the past or maybe there's been some sort of abuse and somebody needs to release their fears and release their their worries and you know open up communicate. There could be fear of fear of communicating. This person is has multiple options. Okay, she is the queen of all queens. So somebody may be fearful of communicating with this beautiful person because she is so beautiful. She really is. She her, her she's beautiful in all ways, okay? She is. So there's 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 definitely some sort of fear here. There's intimidation of communicating with her by the looks of things. Somebody is definitely fearful. I mean, she knows her value. This person knows their value and doesn't move into third party situations. So, I mean, if you are, con if you want this person, if you are the male and you want to connect with this empress, you best not be dealing with any third parties because this person will not have anything. I got so many options, I don't even need to play that game. So, um, this person has multiple options, but doesn't entertain them. She doesn't entertain them because she's looking for the one. So I think we have somebody here that is fearful. I think in this case, this person, we have somebody here that is fearful of communicating and, and going towards this person. But maybe it's fear of rejection, but I do feel like there's a past life connection here with this person. This person is a mother and she probably puts her children first. She puts her family first. If you are younger and you haven't had children yet, this could be a pregnancy. This could be getting pregnant. I'm just saying. But this is a singles reading. So I feel like there is somebody from the past that is reconnecting with somebody. There's a reconnection. Um, there's a reconciliation. And if this is somebody from your past, it could be somebody that, that you have been married to or definitely somebody that you have known before. Um Somebody's going to have to put in effort to really communicate and open up and socialize with this person. This one doesn't chase. She does not chase. She knows her value. Now, this is the queen of all queens, and she is a healer, and she is a giver, and she is generous. She's the giver of life. She's the giver of new life. But with the Seven of Wands, there, this is uh, stepping down, powerless, a fall from power, admitting defeat. Interesting. Somebody needs to... Come down. It's like come down off of your high horse. Interesting. I don't know who that is for. 
let your guard down as well. I see that there is somebody here that is guarded. Obstacles finally being removed. Coming out of a mental, there's some sort of mental situation, mental abuse or something. There is mental abuse here. Somebody hasn't been seen clearly. They've been trapped in their own mind, trapped in their own illusions, trapped in their own negative patterns, their own negative thoughts. Six of Swords reversed underneath it. Okay, that's where I was combining. They've been reluctant to go. They haven't been able to go to another place. They've been unable to see things for how they really are. Somebody has been staying in a situation that was comfortable, but it was really, really hurting them. And they were doing that because they were trying to prove something. I don't know where this is going or why this is coming out of my mouth, but it is. It's like you need to stop fighting for something that... You need to stop fighting. You need to stop fighting, whatever that means. You need to stop fighting. You need to go to this better place. Stop fighting it. Get out of this troubled situation. What are you waiting for? Whatever that means to you. Somebody needed to hear that. I feel like there's definitely a chance for a reunion. This is there is a reunion or a recon, reunion, reconciliation, the past, Re reconciliation, reconciliation, reconciliation with somebody that you have known. And for a lot of you, this is somebody that is, comes from a past life. This is a past life connection. It's somebody you may not have even met them yet in this lifetime, but somebody is guiding you towards this person. This person is beautiful, especially if you are the male. If you are the male, this person is the giver of life. She is nurturing. She will take very good care of you. She puts her emperor on a pedestal. If you are the feminine watching this, then you are the pick, okay? You are the pick. You are beautiful. Somebody is interested, but they are intimidated. They are intimidated because this woman is so graceful this person is so valued you know it's intimidating it's in, they will they know that they won't be able to abuse this person because she knows her value you come correct or you don't come at all and i mean correct there will be no x's in the picture and don't be trying to use the children as an excuse to talk to the ex you can talk to the ex, you know, <laughs> about the children, but people go overboard. No drama for the Empress. None. She doesn't involve herself in that ne unnecessary crap. So anyway, um, we have a feeling or, or a this is like very worried. We have a masculine here that is, is definitely very worried about being rejected. They're worried that this person won't give them the time of day. Perhaps this, this past, in the past, whether it's in the past life or in the past, there was mental abuse or there was some sort of abuse or there was neglect. This is neglect. There was a lack of compromise, and there was a lack of respect, and there was a lack of communication. Somebody, all they did was fight, 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 fight. Maybe that's what needs to change this time. So anyway, Aries, I feel in February there is the, an opportunity for a new beginning here with somebody that you have known before. Be prepared for, you know, to receive a message from somebody or to deliver the message, whichever one you are. Uh, somebody, you know, whoever this, this con whatever this connection is, there's, there's a familiar connection. It, there's an opportunity to work together and to uh, develop a friendship. 
you develop a friendship that a real friendship I mean like become real friends and it could develop into um, or it could blossom into you know some sort of uh, relationship this is definitely somebody that has been hurt in the past this is definitely somebody you have severed ties with in the past and like I said could be past life it's been a constant battle and I think there's been some mental issues okay there's some mental health issues here that has caused something to um, go in the wrong direction but I feel like there is um, a rebirth here a fresh start okay um, something is about to happen that is going to give you an opportunity to start a new life with a very beautiful individual that you are soulmates with. I mean, that's what I see. Um, most likely it's a Taurus or a Libra. doesn't have to be. Could be a Scorpio. Um, but this is going to take effort. It's going to take hard work. It is. It's going to take open lines of communication. It's going to take mutual respect. So I don't know who this person is, but I think there is an op There may be a reconnection with somebody from the past. Now, anybody that puts down below, I don't want somebody from my past did not hear me say this could be somebody from a past life. So you just heard me that time, didn't you? Good luck.